Jane Castor, David Strass, both want to be Tampa's mayor, each fighting their own way to get the job. I am truly honored. Castor is touting endorsements, emphasizing leadership experience, and attending community forums. Political analyst Susan McManus says it's critical for Castor to keep her supporters engaged. One of the things that worries a front runner like Castor is that people will think, well, there was just, it's over, she's won, there's no need for me to go vote. I'm happy to be here once again. Straz has a different way to get his message across, answering voters' questions during live telephone town halls. McManus says that technique can be inexpensive and useful. You have to think if somebody stays on the line that they're really interested in what he has to say and the ability to talk to him directly. Then there are the negative commercials. McManus says it's Straz's way to reach those who don't like Castor. The retired businessman is doing what he can to make up ground. Straz was far behind Castor in the election last month. When you lose the first round of voting by the margin that Strauss did, you have to be creative. Meanwhile, just this Thursday, Castor shot back at Strauss. A new commercial as both candidates strategize their way to the finish line April 23rd. In Hillsborough County, I'm Dahlia Dangerfield, Spectrum Bay News 9.